Talk like that scene is for that when I kill mosquitoes. Demo. Demo time. Do you want to help? I can help. You just throw all of our wood on those pallets over there. Has a bunch of, uh, oh, uh, I want to do a full job, not a boring job. All right, job. I can start taking these gusset plates off and I'll start hauling wood. <laughs> all right, so I just got into my work clothes and we are ready to start tackling some of this stuff. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing though. He just took the wood cart and I don't know how to get up there to get that stuff off. Yeah. What am I supposed to be doing? Samuel, what do you need me to do? Okay, in the sled. Okay. So this is like all freshly split wood and not split wood. And then this is like leftover from last winter that we're gonna move up by the house. It's a tension brace, it's not a compression brace. It's strong. And it's also still attached to the <laughs> <laughs> There you go. As long as talking about collecting rainwater off of the roof since we're gonna be needing a lot more water with the garden this summer. We just found a bunch of like gutter supplies underneath the chicken coop that we're cleaning out since we're moving it. So what are all these pipes from? Do you know? <laughs> no. Um. Oh, I do not want another chicken strider. It's for the chickens. What? It's for the chickens to be coming in and out of. Like baby roast? Baby roast, Dad? Okay, so a little update if you're kind of confused because I'm very confused. I guess the things that the coop was sitting on were not actually attached to the coop. The skid things that they were going to like slide it across all the rollers. So they're trying to attach that right now and they've been working on that for a while. I can't really do anything to help them with that. So. I'm gonna go ahead and get started on working on our garden. Um, actually, it's been a while since there's been a garden here. There's like a ton of stuff that needs to get raked off. So you can kind of see all of this needs to be raked, but those up there, those are all the peonies. And then there's a couple peonies down here in this lower quadrant. And then this is all like open for actual garden stuff and then we have a bunch of raspberries over there. Okay, I'm gonna stop filming. This is gonna take a while. Go to your chickens. Chickens? Yeah. You want chickens? Yeah. Yeah. Well, we're gonna move the chicken coop. We have rollers in front, and we should just be able to pull it with the truck. Easy as that, except I realize we have to somehow turn it. To get it down. This chicken's next summer's thing. I would still do turkeys this summer. You could do a turkey, maybe. Turkeys? What? How many turkeys? Three. Off 
the uh, pipe. Oh, the chain? Yeah, the chain. Did it break or how did it come No, I, I don't know. Good! Whoa, 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 whoa! I think it's good. I think it's good. Reinforcements are arriving right now. Bringing it downhill, you're probably going to want to have a vehicle on each side. It might catch up to you. It's possible. <laughs> yeah. I'm not throwing my body in front of it. So. <laughs> Today. Not willing. Oh. Carburetor or something. Should we bring Dad's bobcat over? <laughs> how, how many tool toys can we use for this project? What's the plan? It's a good question. Two hazel if you want. Otherwise, you stay by the tire. Oh, you're gonna stay by the tire? Okay. You know we are an Alaskan family when Oliver is cleaning the garden and finds a head. <laughs> it's a caribou head. I'm not sure. It doesn't look like a caribou head. Is this teeth? Yeah, those are its teeth. Dad, look at us. Just leave it right there, you can show daddy after, okay?
surprised with all that activity. There is still a moose. Down there. You can't see it. I can see it. I guess the moose is gonna like to sneak up on the chicken coop, just like Ali said. A lot more to go. Gotta get this all cleaned up, get this taken down. Get the wood all hold over there. Level the coop. That was the easy part. What was the easy part, moving it? Yeah. And now we have to level it? <laughs> That's gonna be hard. <laughs> no, I'll just be getting all this little stuff cleaned up. So there are actually two moose out here, which makes me realize my concerns about the dark woodshed and moose are valid, but they're probably too hard to see on the camera. Samuel is relaxing. <laughs> Sorry, the chip bag's empty. Hazel got all cleaned up. I cannot believe how much dirt came off of her. We'll need to clean all of her up. I think we should just eat, get cleaned up, eat dinner. I might try to get some blocks nailed together, but probably won't be jacking on the coop. The second one's back there. You can just see it through the trees. Yeah. It's brighter blonde. Yeah. It looks like a horse. I was like, our neighbors have horses? <laughs> That. The moose is walking away. I know, but I can't believe that. And it's so big, but it's still the baby. <laughs> <laughs> moose are my favorite. They're so cool. This is my favorite too. I, want I can't believe that they're hanging around. Like we have the tractors it. out and saws and it. throwing logs. A and... moose. There's the final product. I don't know. Did he film the final product here? I mean, that's where it, that's where it is. It's not quite finalized. Oh yeah, that's true. It's going to be leveled out and blocked up, but. And here is where we can put a new chicken door in this side and then have an outdoor little area for them here. When we get chickens. Oh, you know, I just realized I got kind of close to where the moose were. But we're gonna get turkeys maybe this year, we'll see. The thought was do the garden first this year and then add chickens next year. But. You want chickens this year? Um, well, maybe turkeys. The only time we raised turkeys was when they threw them like white chicks in with our white chicks and we thought that they got like messed up because there's like an accident with the heat light and we thought they're like mentally messed up because they acted different they looked a little bit funky on their heads and then they grew like a month in we we're like this is so weird like they have a darker head it's a real life ugly duck yeah like we thought we thought that like it burned their heads on the heat lamp for some reason like because i don't know what had happened but something weird had happened and they come to find out there's just three turkeys accidentally got thrown into our, our Cornish cross chickens. And so, but they're fantastic. They're like guard dogs. Like when people came in the driveway, they'd go running up to meet them. And it was just, a, they're just funny. Well, I think that's the end of the video because <laughs> he filmed a lot today. I have no idea how much we'll actually put in. Bye. Bye.